What's up guys, Tim Little, Matt Allen. Welcome back to Tactful Bassin. Today's video, another buyer's guide for you. We're talking $400 combos, right around that $400 price point. We got you covered, let's go. I'm pumped to be at this $400 price point. You guys know, Tim and I put a ton of time in on the water. We naturally use mid to high end gear. That's where we tend to put our time in. We have chosen over the last few years to really expand, and we spend a ton of time fishing $300 combos, $200 combos, true budget combos, so that we can give that good, accurate advice. But that $400 price point is what you cross, that's where you cross over into those combos where we're like, this is here sweet. we go, <laughs> here we go. So to kick this off, we're starting spinning, we'll end with casting. I'm going first and we're talking Zodius. Shimano Zodius paired with the Vanford. You know what, let's not talk Zodius, let's start Vanford. This is a new reel this year. You can pre-order them. They're supposed to be here any day. I've seen a handful of them showing up in stores and vanishing instantly, but you can still pre-order them. They should be here before the holidays. The Vanford is sweet. This reel, I got to put some days in chasing, not just smallmouth, chasing big smallmouth. And if you've caught big smallies, you know they will work you over. I really enjoyed this reel. The only way that I can explain it, well, one, it's ridiculously smooth as I'm sitting here playing with it. <laughs> but the biggest thing with this reel is that it's fast. There is no slop in the reel. When you start to turn that handle, that reel is there. It is connected and it's actually something that you can tangibly feel. You are dialed in with that reel when you're fishing with it. There's no give, there's nothing. It's right there all the time. If you can't tell, I'm really excited about that reel. Yeah, I was I've, just... <laughs> I've had a blast with it. Maybe eventually you can talk. Yeah, I right? was wondering if we can do a whole video just on that reel. <laughs> <laughs> so paired up with the Zodius, the Zodius is a great rod. They actually have run through a, a brand new series. So this is the previous Zodius. You can now pre-order again the brand new version. Tim will talk about the new versions here in a second, but paired up together, it's a phenomenal combo. It is, it's, it's super nice. I mean, those Zodius, the whole lineup was, uh, you know, home runs before. Now that they just made them so much better. Yeah. Paired with that Vanford, that thing is sweet. I got to play around with it quite a bit too. Uh, I'm going to talk about real quick since I'm went over running out of time now. Uh, <laughs> uh, the line, the the cash and rods, you know, both spinning and casting. We're talking uh, spinning right now. This is actually a seven foot six rod. I like a longer rod for uh, light swim baits, Ned rigs, real light stuff. When you hook those big smallmouth, those big spots, that rod really loads deep, keeps them pegged. But mm -hmm. cash and makes a, a phenomenal rod. A little slower, more moderate action, you know, mm -hmm. less tip but it keeps those fish pegged. Went ahead and paired that up. This is the Ultegra 2500, uh, very smooth. And what you're gonna get with all of this gear is longevity. Mm -hmm. You know, that's when you start paying a little bit more money, you're gonna have this gear for years and years and years. You know, some of the other stuff you might've bought at, at cheaper price points, that are a little less expensive, aren't gonna last as long. You know, these cash and rods, rods are super, super sensitive. And uh, the Ultegra, I mean, I've had this reel, um, a few a years. While. Yeah, it's been a while. And it's still s smooth as... They're they, nice. They, they get out of the box, so... All right, switching over to casting. We mentioned this in the last video. And I say last video, if you guys are just coming into this with us, these buyer's guides are running every single day. So yesterday was $200 combos. The day before that was $100 combos. We'll link those down in the video description. Tomorrow... $500 combos, and beyond that, we're gonna have all sorts of fun. So switch into casting. A few years ago, we jumped into the 13 line and we gave it a fair run. Yeah, we got a lot of a lot of recommendations, a lot of questions, and we didn't have any, so we had to go. We had to go try yeah, it. Yeah. Well, this year, we mentioned in yesterday's video that it has been a challenging year to get equipment. You, you break a rod, you wanna try a new technique, you need a rod, you go to buy the one you want, it's not there. So this year, over and over again, we were faced with, again, trying all sorts of new, new gear. So we took that on 
and we tried all sorts of things. One of the combos that I've tried is a 13 Muse paired up with that Concept A2. I had fished a Concept A before. I had not tried the new version of that. I really like this combo. This reel in particular, I mean, the rod's great. The rod's Super crisp. Light. It's very light. It's got a great feel. This reel in particular really surprised me. And I don't know why. I don't even know why I'm saying that, but I guess because you guys know, if you watch the videos, I fish a ton of Shimano. We own all sorts of things, but I just personally, since I was a kid, have fished a ton of Shimano. So if I'm just going fishing, that's usually what I grab and go out the door, unless I'm intentionally trying something new. So when I grab this reel, I mean, in hand, it's just got a different feel. So I got out there to fish with it. The grips are different, everything's different, but I really, really liked it. And I've been very happy with that combo. Yeah, I was I was blown away. It's uh, that that uh, I think we were talking just before this video. I picked that thing up and it was it was super light. Yeah. Um, I don't know if I should do a whole video on this since you did a whole video <laughs> on your combo, but uh, this is the new Zodius. You guys know how much we love the old Zodius. Uh, this out of any of the videos we're going to do in this in this uh, buyer's guide, this is probably the standout for most. In, not even most improved, but like this thing should be at a higher price point. You guys know how much we love the X Prides. They went, they changed the, I mean, they changed the cosmetics, the real seat, it was monocoque, butt section, a very, very sensitive rod, very light, and uh, it just looks sweet. They got the matte black on there with the red, if you guys are all into that stuff, but <laughs> paired that up with a Corrado K, you guys know that those are tried and true. I mean, they're just a workhorse as you can frog, flip, punch, swim bait, all that stuff on that, but uh, the Zodius, I can't say enough good things about them. Again, they come in a ton of models. So uh, d depending on the technique you want, you could find the rod that works great for you. They got cranking rods and, and bladed jig rods and finesse rods, but uh, these new Zodius are, are, are sweet. Yeah. Now, I'm glad that you said technique because down in the video description, like every video, we'll link all the gear. But again, I want to reiterate that in every lineup, there are standout rods. There's that one rod or two or three rods where you're like, that's the one. That one stands out from the entire lineup. So not only are we gonna link the Zodius, we'll give you our favorite models of that with line. each yeah. one of these lines. All right, my last one, sticking at that same price point. You guys, if you watch the content throughout the year, you hear those DC reels screaming. You know we love DC. Well, at any price, Corrado, to go to Corrado DC, you step up in price. So in order to balance that out and get a DC in here, we went down one notch in the rod. So from Zodius down one step to Corrado, and then a reel up one step to DC. This is the Corrado rod paired with the Corrado DC reel. I've been very happy with the rods the last, what, two, two, and, two and, a half. and a half years, something like that, we've been fishing them. I really enjoy the rods. They've got a full handle on a lot of them, not all, but I like that full handle feel. And then that DC, if you guys haven't fished DC, DC is fun and has <laughs> taken over a lot of my lineup these last couple of years. I had fished DC back when we were kids and then it sort of went away. And when it came back, I was like, eh, I don't know that that's for me. I think that's a beginner thing. Mm -mm. No, <laughs> DC is awesome. And I have really put a lot of them in my lineup. That's a great package. Yeah, the whole DC thing is just a whole nother notch in Shimon. It's, it's really cool. And you can turn a dial and set it based on, those of you guys that don't know about it, it's, it's a di digitally controlled braking system. It's literally got a computer in there that it, it checks the speed of the spool like 10,000 times a second and prevents backlashes uh, sometimes. Hey, sometimes. Not, sometimes you still blow them up, but it makes it a lot easier to throw light baits in the wind. There's a lot exactly. of advantages to the DC system. Um, last combo I'm gonna talk about is gonna be this guy right here. This is the Loomis E6X series. I went again with the Corrado K. Just talked about the Corrado K on the Zodius. Just bragged about how much I love the Zodius. The E6, the E6X series, is uh, a line that I really like for specific techniques. They have an entire crankbait and topwater. I mean, they got entire lines for everything. A series. A series of everything, but the crankbaits specifically, depending on the different depths, 
you know, square bill or deep diver, they have specific rods, specific actions that's gonna best fit those techniques. Yeah. And that's why I wanted to add that into this because if you guys are a, a crankbait fisherman, you guys love cranking like we do, they have some of our favorite actions down in this price point uh, d below from the IMX Pro. But the E6X is a great series. It's really nice that they have those E6X because across the board, G Loomis is a higher end right. brand of rods. And there are some models in there that we just live and die by, right? Like the right. 845 CBR. CBR. Right. There's a handful of models that we just, we fish them every single day. But you're going to pay for those Loomis rods. It's really nice that they've got that E6X where it's literally the exact same models just stepped down in price. So you can fish that exact rod without paying as much for it. I'm glad that they did that. That was a good, a good addition in their right. lineup. Yeah, the Zodius, like I said, knocked out of the park. The E6X, like I said, the technique specific stuff, the cranking, all that. You guys know how much we love some of those models in the higher, higher end stuff. And uh, they, they brought it down into that this lineup and uh, they're all winners. Now, speaking of higher end, tomorrow, new videos every single day. We're no longer three videos a week. Tomorrow, we're talking $500 combos. And then we're going from there. We're going ultra high end. Then we'll start branching out into other baits and gear. Guys, we will see you tomorrow. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks, guys.